Hey guys, Boxcorn Zoo here, and welcome back to some more Pokemon Sword. And in the last episode, we've tried to do the Pokemon, uh, well, we tried battling the Pokemon Champion, and it seems that the, uh, Chairman kind of went a little bit dark in fact that he tried to go ahead and restart what is known as the Darkest Day, which basically almost destroyed the enti entirety of Gal Galar region. And we met the two legendary Pokemon, except we really didn't battle them or do anything with them, other than get a rusty sword, which, um, is, I believe, in my key items back, but, uh, that's, that's the point. Uh, okay, apparently not. I just apparently got a rusty sword. I don't know how. Or where it's gone, but it's, oh. Gym Challenger, you must help me. I mean, please help me. My Pokemon suddenly Dynamax for some reason. I started running amok in the stadium. <coughs> Raihan, I mean, Mr. Raihan was able to subdue the Dynamax Pokemon in the stadium, but if other Pokemon also Dynamax on a rampage, the underground power plant would collapse. Mr. Rose is down there right now. I know this is selfish of me, but I must beg your assistance. I want you to. To head into the underground power plant and go to meet for Mr. Rose. Mr. Rose is waking up Pokemon known as Eternus. Apparently the energy emitted from his body is what causes Dynamaxing. At this rate, all Pokemon in Galar Region will Dynamax and go berserk. If that were to happen, please must save Mr. Rose. You can't can take the lift to reach him. I've enlisted the help of Champion Shin's younger brother too, but who knows what's going on. Let's go. What the hell is going on in here? Chairman, you care to explain yourself? And what do you plan on doing, Jim Challenger? Stopping the darkest day. Uh, pardon, what are you talking about? There's nothing to stop now. We've already brought about the darkest day, or should I say, the ultimate Pokemon Eternus. I must explain myself. From your perspective, I suppose it must seem that I'm doing something terrible. I do expect you expect you to understand. I don't expect you to understand, but I must provide Galar Region with limitless energy to ensure an everlasting prosperity. It's my purpose, my duty, and my destiny. That is why I've been given the given the wishing stars to return us. Surely you remember the red light that causes a ruckus around Hamlock? That was all part of our experiments to awaken a tennis. You must understand that I can't let you interfere in my plan to protect the future of Galar. And we're fighting the chairman, of course. Macrocosmos Rose. S. Cavalier! Oh, okay, S. Cavalier. Oh god, don't be like level 60 at all, I swear to god. Okay, you're just level 55. You're just exactly the Pokemon level that my freaking lowest level Pokemon can't even freaking go for. Of course, that has happened. Luckily, my Nintendo can still go ahead and do this. You're pretty tough, yes, entirely too tough. Don't think you that's. Mega Oh, for crying out loud, of course you have that type of freaking power. Cavalier fainted. 62. Hydro Pump. 110. I'm gonna have to use it instead of liquidation, because liquidation is not doing much. Hydro pump instead. Ferrothorn. Corviknight. Huh? 
We're both steel types, so don't try using the steel type move. So it's best use drill pack. Because you're a grass type. Curse. Which raises or lowers something and then raises something. Okay, let's use Brave Bird. Body press. Okay. Corvanite drill pack. Include would you please? Body press once more time. I'm Oh my god, of course Corvanite just faints on the spot. Uh. Okay, Chandler. Fire spin. How you avoid the attack? Fair. Corvanite was very close to level up too. Perskewer. Damn it! Realize something. Talion's very low. Oh my god. You know I'm just gonna have to. I'm just gonna have to. I, I can. I won't be able to beat him otherwise. I'm literally so sorry about this. I'm gonna have to let one of my Pokemon faint. In order to keep my Pokemon fully healed. And actually having a fighting chance here. Because I need to make sure that my Pokemon, or at least oh God, I require a max potion on Intellion. Iron Head. I had a feeling that was going to be super effective. You seem to be a lot of bit about steel types, which was why my Chandelure should probably be the best possible. Pokemon, but I prefer my Inteleon to do this one, because Inteleon has done this so many times for like that, and it's, yeah. Okay, I, I do feel for Cold, but I know them. Clean Clang. Okay, well, I am going straight for my fucking Chandelure. I'm actually happy with Chandelure for this. Maybe one level above me, but I have the super effectiveness on my side. No, you also have super effectiveness on your side. One more attack like that, and you'll be sorry. Hoo hoo hoo. Clean clan. Shand look at level fifty six. Keep my current Pokemon. Oh no, ho ho, I just realized something. I can't get my f Pokemon to max. Oh my god, this is gonna be freaking a train wreck. <sighs> We're gonna have to do it. We're just gonna have to. I'll show you more. 
hit so hard it was speechless. Who said I'll speed you? I have speed you. Yes. I really so so hope you do not actually do too much damage. It's okay. And of course, Chandler gets completely backed. Shoot. Down to my last three Pokemon. Okay, I should be able to outspeed you. That doesn't mean anything. Because max moves are fucking. Uh, of course. I'm gonna have to revive some Pokemon. And I need to max revive them. Chandelure is gonna be one of them. Max Quake. Oh god. Did I tell you on this one? Yes. Tell you on my strongest Pokemon. Fainted. But Chandelure is out for revenge. I'm not Dynamaxed anymore. And neither are you. I don't expect my to go easy on ya. Cause fire spin is gonna be the thing that's buggered you up. There you go. You're down. You feel good level 56. I'd forgotten how great Pokemon battles are. It's been so long since I battled. That was surely satisfying. That's impressive, Charles. I wouldn't expect any less from a challenger endorsed by the strongest champion ever to the grace of the Gal Galo region. I really do wish I, have, I could have seen the championship match between you two. I'm totally sorry I had to ruin the whole gym challenge and everything. It's too bad, but it can't be helped. In order to solve the energy issue as soon as possible, we awakened Eternus, but we could, cannot control it. The champion can't aid me even at the cost of abandoning the match. Indeed, I just like a knight in shining armor coming to rescue a princess from a dragon. I do tend to run blind, I know. I uh, think of speeches, but I think I can stop talking now. I think the champion should have captured the tennis by now. If you're curious, you can take the lift up. And I trust you'd be going too, right? Hop, I certainly hope you lose some me too. To me, it didn't discourage you too much. Go on now, both of you. Go and see our champ. Oh, you didn't... Don't get it, do you, Chen? Neither me nor my Pokemon are anywhere near giving up. We've learnt how to be strong thanks to the gym challenge you organized. Okay. Alright, Charles, I'm ready for anything, are you? Of course. We don't expect anything from this one, I'll have come on, we have to go and help Lee. Eternus. You came out to help me in spite of danger. Thanks, Harp and you, Charles. You two really have grown tremendously. But no need you kids to worry. It seems like some power of Eternus was keeping my team from Dynamaxing, but we've had a champion time all the same. Charizard and the rest of my champion team members have really worn, worn Eternus down. 
Now if I can simply catch in a Pokeball, we should be able to get this madness under control. Then everything will be back to normal. So watch this, it's going to be a real champion catch. the Pokeball. Oh, no. A turn has appeared. Shand oh, shoot. I just realized I'm going to want to find it. Uh, turn I don't know what type you are. Um, good quick ball. Let's see how. Oh my god, you can't throw a pokeball. Oh my goodness gracious me, I just realized I'm in a big ass trouble. I'm in big trouble. I'm in huge, gigantic, mega, ultra, super trouble. Well, I'm mega healing you. What one? Dynamax cannon? The hell is that thing? Oh my god. I just wiped out my entire team with that thing. That's right. Dragon Pole. Okay, okay, you're a dragon type. Okay, that's good. That's nice to know. Nice to know. I feel like I'm a little under leveled for this, but. Frost Slash should be able to do help all the same. Now, if we can just use Frost Breath, we should be okay. How many moves do you have? God, I can't get anywhere with this. I really should have asked fucking Hop to heal my fucking team. Because clearly I can't get a fucking shot in edgewise. <laughs> get it? Shot. Dragon Pulse. No, but go and borderline almost kill me. I can't. I can't deal with this. How many max survive? I got two. Okay, I'm gonna have to use a max survive on fast last, and if uh, Inteleon faints, I'm gonna have to go ahead and mm, yeah, see what I think. Regardless, flamethrower is still gonna be enough. This is a level 60 Pokemon. Okay, so. It, it's gonna still basically be the most impossible to deal with. Um, the, the XP from it will be very massive. Dynamax can. Oh my god. I really hope this Dynamax can is not gonna one shot my first last, but. He has to. Yeah, it just does one. I can't even get a hedge in edgewise. Like, literally, I can't. I've got one Pokemon. And I've got one max revive left. Oh god. And the only one that did damage was freaking my Inteleon. Barely, but it did damage. I, I, I'm gonna have to now rely on revives now. And even then, that's gonna be very risky. So I can't throw. The thing is, I can't throw Pokeballs. Although it says I. I have the ability to. Um, like, look, you know, I'll sh uh, quickly just try and throw an Ultra Ball. Because I can't throw a Pokeball. So I'm gonna use a Hydro Pump. <sighs> Flamethrower. Yes! Of course, I found a way that actually you are now actually going to go ahead and keep doing that. If you keep doing that, that's actually pretty good. But, Snipe Shot does slow a nice big damage as well. Of course, now you're using this Dragon Pulse. Oh 
I'm full with storing. I, I don't care. I have to. Italian is the only one who can actually fight this thing. I'm sorry. All my team is just not gonna be. It's just gonna cross poison. Okay. And you. I had a f one full restore. I don't have that many. Okay, it looks like I'm just gonna have to hydro pump one more time. Oh, I just fucking do this. Oh! Oh! Oh my god. Cross poison. Oh god, that poison better not kill me, better not kill me, better not kill me. Oh, Inteleon, Inteleon, you literally just have to use one more snipe shot. Quick. Thank you, Inteleon. You are my jam, my little jam. Um... Okay, we're taking on together with Hop. Wait, please say my Pokemon are actually, like, fully healed, if that's the case. Okay. Well, I'm Hydro Pumping, I'm gonna go ahead and tell you that much. What? I can't use any moves. Due to a mysterious power. I forgot. We found the sword and shield in the slumping wheel. Charles, use that sword. It might be old and rusty, but there's got to be some use to it. Oh, there they are! The sword and shield. Legendary. Gina Zama Zenta.
attacking. Nice with the light screen. Like we need some moves now. Thanks to Sashin and Zamazenta, that is. Double edge. Alright, your phone. Oh my. Blade. Hydro pump. Double edge. Damn that blade. Let's do a big, huge damage. Through that Pokemon right there. Zashium with that blade again. Turn this on its red lost health. Sorry guys. Apologies. Sneep shot. Hi, horse attack. Nice. That's actually super effective as well. Squeeze copy sneep shot. Yay, attack rose. Attack rose. Attack rose. Attack rose. That was a one shot. Hurry! Can't even catch Tennis now. Catch. Ooh, what should we catch him in? Oh. 
friend ball maybe? Hmm. Luxury ball and ultra ball. Pokemon best catch an opposite gender, but it doesn't have a gender. No, I'll use a dust ball. Windham. Three days later. Hmm. So Chairman Rose turned himself in, then never sleep the same day. He woke a turn and nearly caused a catastrophe ca catastrophe of the entire region. You reap what you sow, I say. I don't know about you, but I slept like the dead. Yeah, we're still talking about what happened, but at least things are back to normal now. We really did defeat the tunas together with Zamazenta and Zashi. And still, Lee's well, he's being the sister and having a championship match with you today. It's a bit much, isn't it? You showed up for it? I'm not even too sure about him. He was out cold, hurt pretty badly. Soft you and all that mess. I do understand how he feels though. Feels like I've been waiting forever to get to see you and him and him face off in a serious match. Come on. The match will be at window still, what else? Okay, looks like it will be should be facing him. What was the Pokemon like? You are Eternus, what the... Damn. So it was Cross Poison, Dragon Pulse, Flamethrower, and Dynamax Cannon. Oh. You are a very strong Pokemon. Um, yeah, but I'm not going to use you in, in, in the challenge because... Uh, that's just a little bit cheating, and I'm, I'm, I'm just, I'm just thinking that's a little cheating. But, um, yeah, that's just a little cheating. Uh, I just, I believe that. But I'm gonna go, and I'm just gonna go to the, the stadium, and then I'm gonna go ahead and say, hold on, let me quit that. I just spent a book all like right two feet away from me, and air balloon. Stadium. And one thing that I want to go ahead and do is I'm going to go ahead and end this video off, and the next episode we shall be going after the champion. Oh, and after that, my friends, yeah, I can't wait. Okay, without further ado, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like the video, box like buttons, really appreciate it. Not only here, if you're new out here, why not subscribe for more? Pokemon Sword, and as always, I'll see you, she, see you in the next one. Happy gaming. Come on.